We are making an easy teacher gift today. I'm gonna to show you how to make a gift box out of cardstock and some stickers all using your Cricut. Hey, I'm Sarah. You're watching Creative Ramblings. Thanks so much for being here. I love sharing simple, inspiring projects. Today, we are making a really simple gift box. This is a two-part process. We are going to make a foldable box out of cardstock and stickers to go on top of it. So over in Cricut Design Space, you're going to need two images, a box and this beautifully designed print then cut stickers. The details on both of these are down in the description. So we're gonna work with the box first and we're gonna do this by just hiding the sticker for now. I wanna make sure that the box is sized appropriately, that it's gonna fit on a 12 by 12 sheet of paper. And I also wanna make sure that the sticker is sized appropriately to fit inside the box. But again, we're gonna work with that sticker later. Once the box is sized appropriately, I'm gonna click make it and send it over to my Cricut Maker 3. Now here it says I need to score and cut this. So I'm going to use two tools in both clamps on my machine. The first thing to do is select the material. I am using a heavyweight cardstock here. Next, under tools, there are a couple different ways to score cardstock. You can use a scoring wheel or a scoring stylus. I do not want to use the wheel, so I'm going to click edit tools and I'm going to click on the stylus. I've had the stylus since my Air 2 and it works great with the Maker 3. So I'm just going to use that. It's gonna tell me where to put each tool. And then I'm gonna head over to my machine and score and cut this out. fold all the pieces on here so wherever there is a score line I am just going to fold it over. Now I'm going to grab a tape roller and just start assembling the box. it is all folded you just pinch the sides together on the top and that little flap closes over the top of it now back in design space I am going to hide the box and we're gonna work with this sticker I'm gonna duplicate it till I have eight on a page and then I'm gonna start the print then cut process so I'm gonna send it to my printer and I am gonna choose to use my system dialog box I am using matte sticker paper that's really thick and so I like to print it with cardstock settings. I choose photo printing, make sure it's that eight and a half by 11, high quality print, and I choose to print it from the rear tray. The printer that I use is down in the description. It is a Canon, it's budget friendly, and it prints with beautiful color. I love using this for stickers. Then I head back to my maker and I place that sheet of stickers on my mat and it's gonna recognize the black box around it and cut out my stickers. To assemble this gift, I am just placing one of these stickers on the front of the box. Then I'm gonna pop in a coffee gift card and close up the little flap on the back. This is a really simple gift. It can be used at the end of the year. It could be used for a holiday or a birthday. It's a nice way to thank a teacher for all that they do. You can find the files for the box and the sticker down below, as well as the materials and everything else that I used in this video. Just check out the description. If you liked this, if you learned something today, give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing so you don't miss my next video. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.